today's lesson today's which day money monday today is which day money monday, monday. Do on money Monday. When we talk about uh, we talk about we discuss or talk about money. Oh, money. okay. I am so excited. Before we 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 discuss about today's topic, thank you so much for everyone who has subscribed. We really do not take it for granted, and for the people who have not subscribed. Please subscribe now. Ring the bell. Ring the click the red button. Return subscribe. Now, yes, like that. Ring the bell. Subscribe, and we will be happy to have you in our family. Queen's family. Yeah, you'll join the Queen's family, and you will enjoy yourself. So, Feva, take us through today's topic. Today's topic is about. Just in case. Okay, what do you mean by just in case? Like when when you get help or when you're out of money, you you go to and you've saved some money in the bank, you go to the bank and get the money and you can and you can use it for the trouble that you have. Well done. So it's your backup plan. Oh well done. It's called a backup plan. So your backup plan comes in only if it's an emergency, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. So when you're out of money, yeah. then you're in an emergency. Go to so you go to the for the backup plan. Most of the time, where do we keep the backup plan? In the bank. In the bank as or, savings, or, mm -hmm. on, or in your saving bank. In your saving bank or in or the in the big bank or, or in your laptop or in your laptop. So the the backup plan the backup plan can be the money that you've kept in the bank, but also it can be insurance. Do you know what insurance is? Mm. Bobo, do you know insurance? Yes. What is insurance? No. Uh -huh. Something you have. Mm -hmm. You did right. Well done. So that is the work of the insurance. They come and you in. Think what you found for money. Okay. So what happens when you take insurance is they will always come in and fill in the gap just in case something happens. Yes. Just in case yes. your your car is hit and you need to repair it and you don't have money, the insurance pays for you there. Money. The money. Just in case. You've lost your job and your children need to go to school. What does the insurance do? It pays for you your money. Your school fees. It pays for you the school fees. So that is the just in case scenarios. But we are Christians. We are Christians. God always has our back. So if God always has our back, we should always learn to trust in him. Always. Always. To trust in him with everything that we have. Even with the insurances, without the insurances, our only trust in should God. be in God. Because God has said, trust in him with all your heart and lean not on your own understanding. Your own understanding could be, you're saying, I have insurance. So even if I lose my job, nothing will really happen. They will come in. Yes, they will come in. But remember, God is our Number one yeah. has our back. Also, it is good to plan. And when you plan and when you have the money for just in case something happens, you're better placed. Because we, we learned that Solomon yesterday asked for wisdom. What did he ask for? He, he asked for wisdom uh -huh. and knowledge. He asked for wisdom and knowledge. So wisdom and knowledge teaches us that even if we are Christians, we have to think about just in case scenarios. Just in case something happens, God, I have an insurance to help me think about it in case something happens. Because do you know there are people who have actually lost their money in many ways, especially yes. now during COVID? Very many people have, have lost their jobs. They don't have jobs to work. And Some they don't have the money. Some of them are in hospital. Exactly. Some of them, you, 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 you are in hospital. You had not thought about it. You need to pay the bills. So if you don't have an insurance to come in and pay for you the insurance, what will happen? 
see mm -hmm. the backup plan mm -hmm. will help you in the end. Exactly, which mm -hmm. can be the medical insurance, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes. For your hospital, mm -hmm. for your for your work, for getting mm -hmm. a new job, mm -hmm. for and if you earn money in the new job yes and even as you save always have that money where that you've kept aside for just in case i also read the bible proverbs 22 let me get my book proverbs 22 proverbs 22 26 says don't guarantee to pay someone else's debt remember when you guarantee to pay okay. someone's debt and you're becoming there just in case let me finish the verse it says proverbs 22 26 okay. this is the third third way saying it says don't guarantee to pay someone else's debt if you don't have money you might lose your bed don't guarantee to pay someone else's debt don't guarantee to be someone's just in case if yeah. you're not sure that That's you can be there just in case because you might end up losing your own things the bed is a symbol of all the things you can lose just because of being someone's guarantor just because of not being able to say no which is a topic we'll discuss another day this is so today what is the lesson that you should always have a backup yeah. so let's save for children we should save for parents it is good to actually take these backup plans in terms of savings in terms of insurance in terms of any other plans that are out there to cover us just in case we are not playing for those things god is by our side but just in case they happen we have those plans in place okay. guys that is the lesson for today we have a challenge that we'd want you to put the comment to put the answers in the comments below Eva will read the kids challenge I will give the adults challenge we will give the babies challenge it's called a scenario okay yeah my scenario is the whole family goes to the library and you borrow a book that you have wanted to read for a long time as soon as you get into the car you start speaking when the car stops you are almost at the end of the chapter and you don't want to stop. Mom allows you to take the book into the restaurant and finish the chapter. That night, when you plan to read your new library book and you realize that you can't find it, the next day you go back to the restaurant and ask, but no one has seen the book. You can't find it anywhere. But what I will found... you do? Okay, good. Um, I will I will give this challenge for us as adults to think. We might have a good job right now. We might have a, a, a good business that is running very well. But are you ready just in case your source of income is not there anymore. Have you planned for it? Have you planned for your children, for your, for for the few months to come? These things are happening to very many people. And I think it is good that we actually think about the just-in-case plan. plan. So, bye-bye. Bye-bye. See you again tomorrow. A day, another lesson, and another life change. Bye See you bye. there. Remember to hit the notification bell and subscribe like this. Ting, ting, ting. We already lost it. <laughs> ting, ting, ting. And ring the bell like ting, 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 ting. ting, 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 ting. ting. And, com and remember to comment down below the With answer. your answers. And we write the, the scenario if you don't. If On you the description box. Bye-bye.